hi guys welcome and welcome back to another vlog with me today As you guys seen I just did a quick little speed clean um, yeah so my cleaning lady my cleaning lady retired now so I'm just waiting for the floors to dry Hi. so I thought I've had a lot of people ask about um, my little bunny so he's just chilling I don't know why he wants to play shy it's here say hey I'm right here say hi ow you don't put hair all over me, please, and thank you. Say hi, guys. Say, I'm Blue. Say, my name is Blue. Yes, he was here before the business. Um, <laughs> okay, I didn't want the hair all over me, though. That's why you're in a blanket. Okay. Let me see. I don't know if he's gonna I'll try to get, like... Hi. Okay, I know. You're like, Mommy, get that in my face. Don't look, it's not playtime. Stay. Say hi, guys. I know. You're like, what is this in my world? So that is him. He's a dwarf bunny, so he doesn't. This is as big as he'll get. He's three. So. Say hi. Say hair everywhere on me. Whoa. Well, that's it. Don't. Oh, I know, but don't. Don't do it. Ugh, oh, you're gonna make me sneeze. I love you, but can you please don't jump everywhere? So we got this for Blue today. A little pink bunny for a toy for in his little area. You like her? Do you like her? And you want to get out and run and play, and it's just not happening. It's just not happening today. I told you, I'll put you out next week. Anyways, guys, so yeah, I do put them out. I have, like, a dog runner, which is, like, a pretty big, like, metal cage thing. That I literally just clear out the whole living room, and I put him in that to run around. So I usually let him out and do that, like, I try to do it once a month. Um, and let him stay out for, like, a week for exercise and stuff. <laughs> But it's been like two months, I'm not going to lie, I've just been crazy busy. And it's not even so much that being crazy busy, because like, it's not like it really like interrupts my life or anything. I just move the carpet, move the ottoman, and set it up, and he just runs around and plays. Um, but he just got over shedding like crazy. So I usually don't like to put him out when he's like really going through that shedding phase. And he's, I don't know, I feel like he's uncomfortable when that happens. So he just wants to be kind of left alone and does his thing in his little home. So that is it. You guys were asking what? Yes, you were asking what your name was. Let's say my name is Blue. Because I have blue eyes. Okay, well don't do it. He's just like on my lap. I wonder if I like try to like put you guys down. Let's see. He'll try to run. Ow. Well don't run then, please. Don't need the blanket. Hi. Say hi now, family. Hi, guys. What do you try to play shy for? It's not a bug in a rug. Say hi, peeps. Say bye. Say another day. Say another day. So that's him, guys. He's like three, so he won't get any bigger. So I'm a grown, I'm a grown young man. And I know it's not that um, you guys never asked this or anything, but 
if you are like a buddy owner, um, he is fixed. Um, because if not, he would be a lot more aggressive. They will be more aggressive and pee and just spray everywhere. So I don't know. My opinion, I definitely, when I was able to get him fixed, I did when he turned, I think it would be like one around that. So when I first got him, okay, what is your issue? When I first got him, um, I kind of wanted a girl, but I'm, I'm glad he's a boy. I'm glad you're you. I wouldn't trade you. That's it, guys. That's him. He's a dwarf. He's, a, he's another than dwarf, but he's mixed with something else. He's not a purebred another than dwarf. Okay. You're mixed with a different type of dwarf. You're two dwarfs. Alright, guys. I'm just going to put him back in his cage. So he can go chill and eat his lettuce. Go to your room. Go to your room. Go no, go to your room. Go to your room. Good boy. Here you go. Good boy. Good boy. Hey guys, I'm just gonna quickly pause you. I'm gonna go wash my hands. Alright guys. Sorry. I always wash my hands after playing with him. At the end of the day, he's still still an animal. There's still hair. So <sighs> I have to, I don't know, like, I never had allergies or anything to him, but I think as time goes on, like, I can't deal with, like, when he's shedding, it's too much. But I always have him in, like, a blanket when I hold him or play with him on me because I just can't deal with all the hair everywhere. It's not my jam. Can't do it. Sorry. So, today, um, yeah, I just want to give a quick speed clean. I feel like I have a hair on my lip. Um, so I did that, like I said, my cleaning lady retired. <laughs> no, I'm, I'm my own cleaning lady, so I, she wants a raise, that's what I'm saying, I'm putting it out there. Um, so I do want to see what I have, I know I have my weekly, so I did that all last night, I got my weekly um, to do, which I did quite a bit yesterday, actually I was, I was impressed, I did, I got like two hauls done. We even vlogged, which was awesome. Um, thank you guys so much. Like the feedback, so great. I'm glad you guys are enjoying. Um, like I say, I say I'm alone. Why does it make? I feel like this side. I have to tighten that strap. Is it always that side that falls? It's annoying. Okay. Um, come with me. So you guys are on my little table. So this is where I um um um, um I edit. Um, so I have like a little chair here that I just edit and I got a little table for the side It's not as tall as I wanted. I wanted a table to go tall and then to go over almost like a lap desk but I don't know. I guess I didn't measure it. This little um, It's actually a fold out little single bed, which is great because my home is small So when I have guests and stuff and I just have a one bedroom, right? So when I have a uh, guest and stuff, they just sleep out here on this which is convenient I don't like people sleeping on my couch like it's I've never liked that um yeah so it's really good when you have guests and stuff so when my brother visits and that then he sleeps out here when my mom visits I sleep out here so um yeah it's not tall as I wanted it to be but it still works I usually have my laptop here and then I got this from Amazon it's just a desk thing which needs a wipe down um but it's good, like, and to be honest, like, I'm not going to lie to you guys, I am most comfortable, like, in my bed or, like, just lounging. Like, this, like I said, chair is more like a lounger. Um, I don't know, it kind of was hurting my back yesterday, but I don't know why. Maybe my back's just sore. Um, yeah, so, like, it literally is perfect for me, and then I just write whatever I need here, and then I usually have my laptop where you guys are sitting, so it works pretty hand in hand, and then... And my TV so I can watch you guys. Or just other YouTubers or whatever I feel like watching in my day. Um, I don't even know what I'm going to do with you guys yet. Um, I can't wait till I can have it. I can do it like two, two things so that way two cameras. In time though. I'm a very impatient person and I think that's like my problem. 
I went to the Dollar Tree actually earlier today too and I got a couple things. I want to kind of organize these drawers a little bit better. I'm not liking the way that they're like functioning for me. So I'm just really, I was over here because I was waiting for that to dry. I think it should be dry by now. Like I don't put a wet, like a wet, wet mop on my floor and it's just over the plastic thing. It's just like a damp ish. And I try to find those other clear containers and the Dollar Tree I went to today because I have two Dollar Trees by me. I have one kind of, I have one West and one East. Um, the West one, I went there like a week ago or so and they didn't have the trays that I got today. So I wanted to go to the East one. And I went to the East one, they had the trays that I wanted, but one of my lovely subscribers was asking about the little stackables that I use and what brand or company. Um, I showed in the little speed clean, I think I threw it out now though, uh, what brand these ones are. I don't know if it'd be the same though. But yeah, I could, girl, I didn't have any there. So I could, I'm so sorry, I couldn't help you with that. I was gonna try to film like Dollar Tree. You guys, I'm too scared. <laughs> don't judge me. I don't, I'm shy. Like, this is why I think this is hard for me, but. All right, so today I know what I have to do. You know what I have to do today? Because you guys are going to be so bejeez with me if I don't get that done. And I have like, my face is itchy now. I wanted to show you guys Blue because you guys have been asking about his name and am I going to see him? He's kind of, he's kind of popped in there though in a few videos. I have like, I could feel like one hair on my face or a fur, whatever you want to call it. Yeah, I didn't do a lot of makeup today, guys. My face does not like makeup, I'm telling you. I don't, I don't know. I swear, it's not like, it's like a bad angle at me. It looks like I have like fucking seven chin. Sorry. No cussing. Looks like I have like seven chins. I'm not the skinniest, but damn. Um, the hell was I saying? <laughs> so I didn't film that though, because I'm just too shy. I'll get there though, where I can do it more in public and show you guys different things and stuff, but. It was really busy too though, like I don't, everyone was really busy. Oh, I went to the post office, I had to do that today. I shipped out um, my Facebook winner um, package today, like, which wasn't bad. I had a question for them anyways, I forgot to tell you guys, I got a P.O. box now guys, uh, I did that yesterday, I don't I didn't even remember to tell you guys in the vlog. I forget a lot of things that it is important for like to tell you guys, but like I'm just so not used to everything yet. That it's like it almost slips my mind like you guys are the reason i got the p.o box but it's like oh let's not tell the people right um i'll get better at that i think as i get like go along i was always gonna wait till i hit a thousand because i'm like i don't really need it but i have had a few people reach out and i've had a, a couple um even smaller businesses reach out and want me to show a few things on my channel for them so i which i would be honored to so I just thought it'd be a lot easier than putting my address out there and it's just easier and safer with like, you know what I mean? Crazy world we live in. Like, don't send me some dead chicken or something. Can you imagine? I swear I seen that like somewhere on YouTube. But you know what they get you, right? Like, you know when they have um, the thumbnail and it's like this intriguing weird thing? Like for instance, I'm gonna show you like, I like, I love watching animal stuff and then some of the safari stuff where you see like an animal like get hurt it's like you don't want to watch it but then you kind of want to see it like so they had one where there was an elephant like the whole back side of it was like ripped off and there was like these wild dogs on it in that whole video i was like and i know it's crazy because i kind of clicked on it because of that i was like how could they get that elephant like uh so i that once did i see a dog try to eat an elephant not that i'm glad i don't want the elephant to die but i was like that's trickery so they didn't get you like that but i do try to like get my thumbnails to look good because some of them do better than others like my nail this one the review of my nails or not the review sorry like me doing my nails that video like the video is doing well the watch time's doing well but the initial clicks there is not that well so i did change it i kind of like the other one better but i think i'm just like i'm not great with like my pictures yet or my angles i need to well, that's actually a pretty good look right there if I take my face out of it. No? Alright guys, let's go to the studio! That's just right there. It's like, right there. Alright guys, hi! So I did put you in my drawer here. Um, this drawer is like the second in my Alex drawer system. So today I got 
these little rings. I like the small rings for when I want to just do individual, like I know all this is one collection. So I've been kind of doing that with the Benedita. And then I just got these little um, note cards and envelopes for just like my little thank you cards. I got some other ones from the Dollarama that I've been using, but they're all the same. And so when I do good do giveaways, I like to put like a little thanks. So these are the ones that I got today. Uh, and what I was thinking, I want to show you guys. Ow, I gotta get a pillow for this floor. This looks so hard. Coming down. We're chilling, guys. All right, so what I was thinking of this. Oh, guys, I really wanted to show you. I did show you, well, I wanted to show you, and then I didn't put it in the video. I don't know. These little things, I will put a picture up of this. I got them from Sheen, and they're just like, they were like for markers or something. These little guys that you get, like these will come from Allie. They're little Lily Cute um, polishes and stuff. Fit beautifully in here. And even these CADS um, stamping polishes work, like they fit perfect. Like, so I got these for them. The Melody Susie, or not Melody Susie, why is that in my brain? Um, sorry, the Venelisa liner brushes, they don't fit, they're too big. So these fit good too, like probably any stamping polishes like this fit nice. They're too tall though for these drawers. So they won't work if you have this drawer system, but they would work in the other drawers, like the taller ones, like the nines or the desk drawers. So that's the thing. So my idea for this was, because this is all stamping, and I really like to just to have my stamp. I'm gonna put these in things though, I haven't done that yet. I have a lot of these. So I used to have these in books, and I'm not reaching for them. And I really wanna to try to get into stamping, but I wanna to try to get some layered stamping plates. So I just have a lot of these smaller ones for now. I kinda of did this to them. It doesn't really make sense yet. But this is what I want to put these bigger ones in. I have a whole whack of these that I got from Sheen. And I think they're fine to keep my stamping plates in. Like, it's a little bit bigger, but eh, that's not bad. Until I can find a better method, I just am not feeling the book right now. I think that's my, like, so I just wanted to put them in here like that. And then I just keep my little ruler there, and then that's it. But I got to put them in those, like, I just don't have any extras in there, which I don't know why I wouldn't put extras, but whatever. Okay, so I want to put one of these in here, which it should fit perfect. Will that come up? So that will come up too. There. I don't know, I just feel like even for these, Oh, these are glow in the dark. So here I have like glow in the dark. I have, let me just, whew, sorry, glow in the dark liners. These are watercolor Mika powder ones that I've made with just alcohol. And they work really good. Obviously they're gonna need a good shake, but like they weren't bad. It was a fun experiment. So I do hold them. So these are more over here. So my thought was either but then these are cat eye, and I have some cat eye in here. I could move that up there, but I think I like it better here because I have a little bit more here. I don't know, guys. I kind of like the way that looks, though. And then I can just put whatever I need in here. Like, if I want to put extra, like, stampers or anything that I do have. Because my other stamper drawer is pretty full, so it could kind of work. Now, this one down here, I wanted to get one for here too. Like here I have all my chromes and I know I'm gonna have specific stampers for chromes and I think I wanted to be able to just keep them with them. Don't mind these guys, these all have to be redone. Like my watercolors are not down here anymore. They're all up here. But I like the way that looks. Like I think I'm, I'm satisfied with that. And then I have room to grow. So these are all cat eyes. So I can grow back. These are just mixed. Well, really, this is glow in the dark. And then I have the eggshell, which, like, can stay here, I think. I don't know. I might put some of those liners in the bottom of these just to keep it. 
from falling, but yeah, and then like I said, I have room to grow. This one shouldn't even be there because it's not the same length, but I have more of these in my other in my storage area I have. These work really, really good too, guys. I used to have this whole thing lined with all these. They fit in there really nicely. I did have to chop the tops off, but it worked fine. Um, but I really like this system because they hold a lot. The only thing about this was kind of like, uh, is that there was like one extra. But whatever. Yeah, so guys, a little thing that I do for all my chromes. I haven't shared this yet. So all of my chromes, I just number them and then I put a swatch, just a plain nail. There's no black on it or nothing. So you see the true color. And so I'll just move this out for a second. So this is all of them. The whole big set that I got many, many moons ago. Well, not many moons, but like last year from Amazon. When I didn't even know what the heck to do with them. I just hauled these. I'm not a fan of them coming in that package because it's, they're just a mess. But what I really like to do. And the reason I have numbers. Is because so say if I okay number one instead of just switching or using them all what I like to do uh, so I know that they go together they're in little bags and then the same way they're all numbered and then any of new ones I get like these ones are more than newer ones so that one I haven't okay I used it I did use it sorry but yeah so they're just it keeps it so much more organized you can reuse it a lot longer than just trying to mix them all the time. So that's a good little trick. And then I like to use these little containers that I get from Dollarama. These are all the very long ones, so there is a difference in the size. But like I said, I keep all of my sponges and just like anything chrome related in that. So I think which will probably happen here is that I ideally would like to, for any chrome stamping, I can just keep it in that. I really wanted to see if two fit, but I tried it, and again, like a smidge. I would like that would be so sick if that would just fit. And because these are so cheap, just even taking off that's not good, but just even taking off the tag, not the tag, but you know the sticky thing with the name of it on. I cracked one. This one I think I cracked. See. It's fine, like I'm still using it, but I'm just saying. So I don't really want to force it because it will bust. But this, I will probably, I have more of these too. I think I have one more of them, but I didn't go to Dollarama today. So I will probably put that back there and then I could probably go one more down there. So. Should I go like that? No, I feel like I'll get more use out of two of these, but for now that can stay there. So guys, that's it for that. Little tips and tricks.
Hey guys, so I just got finished doing two swatch and reviews of the Venalisa products. I still have my thing on. I should probably take that off. Um, I always try to wear like an apron or something because, well, I'm a klutz. This is going to get everywhere. But I do have to just quickly top coat. So I just want to do that quick, guys. But I thought I'd just throw you on. We can chat a little. I did put my laptop, I, I brought my laptop out for a minute. I want to see while I'm in the studio, kind of answer some of you guys back from my latest haul. I did have somebody tell me to go watch something, I think. I've seen it on my phone, but I wanted my phone. I have to start using my laptop anyways. Like, it's just that time. But my big girl Britch is on. Keep on trucking. Country. A little too country. It's okay. I like it. Clear top coat. But guys, I think this is going to look really, really sick in my drawer though. And then we'll do some labels. I'm just, I'm literally working off my week planner right now and I don't like it. Anyways, we're not here for that. This I want to show you guys. Isn't that like a cute little wheel? This is the platinum. The super platinum gel. I have to label them. And then, oh, did I miss any? Ooh, I'm good. I didn't miss any. This is the shiny platinum. So my idea is to, when I put them in my drawer, I have to put them away now. Um, and then I have all the swatches. And I feel like, there we go. I usually have these. So this is how I keep them in my drawer, the pro my product review drawer. So any products that um, either are sent to me or if I have hauled them and I want to review, swatch, kind of show you guys a separate or like an extended part of that. So you guys get to see all like all the goodness of it, right? In a haul, I've said it, I guys, it's too much for me to swatch in hauls. Like, I don't. So I've come to realize some things I'm not even going to put in the haul. I will just do a separate, I guess, a review swatch thing like that. So you don't have to see it twice. I thought I got glitter all over my hat. <laughs> it's my nail. Freaked me out. Yeah, so you guys don't have to see all of it like that. I'm trying to start doing that. But when it's like a lot of products, I like to do like one big product haul. Guys, I'm no different than you. I'm learning... I do things right we're all different what works for me may not work for you and vice versa oh yeah I wanted to look for that video this is why things don't get done I swear well things actually I learned things get done it's just in a cluster so guys I have this little it's a little cleaning thing it's for brushes I get it from um Sheen so what I do, I probably have to put more. Should have left my little thing on. So I'm just gonna leave them in there for a few minutes. Set it over there, try not to forget about it. Remind me, like five minutes. All that's in that, is I don't like to clean my brushes with something too, too harsh. It's just alcohol. I wanna check out, just quickly, one of my fellow subscribers asked me, or told me to check something out. Now I want to go check it out. I tried to look for it on the TV and I couldn't find it on the TV, which is weird. So I'm just going to actually, I'm subscribed to her channel. Rose has a haul. She just did a haul. I gotta watch that. I'm like holding my chin up. <laughs> click on her and then maybe I can click on her face and then I'll tips and tricks so I found it it's awesome that's what she was telling me to go check out that's awesome you're welcome that's awesome that's a good tip it's funny I was actually doing that though <laughs> I love it oh yeah totally about this thingy guys you didn't remind me yeah guys so go check her channel out um it's Tammy's nail techniques so I just want to make sure I'm saying it right so you guys can um, go check her out. She has some good tips and tricks. Share the love. I'll do it later. I wanted to check out that video though. 
um, because I know later I will I will have so much editing now to do because I'm gonna have to figure out what I'm gonna do with this thing. For the platinum gel, we did the super and the shiny today, so that's awesome. I'll have to edit that later, but in those videos, in all honesty, there's not much editing to do. Even in hauls, there's not much editing to do. So I got shiny and I, what did I say? And super, super. Funny when I go through here and I see myself, I'm like, I don't want to watch you. I've seen that. I'm not gonna lie though, it's you're pretty good though. You know you're okay when, like, I rewatch myself and I laugh at myself. So, I guess that's a good thing. If I have nail art in the background when I'm doing stuff, I feel that like I'll miss out. It's, it's kind of almost like pointless to watch it, but like hauls and like like room tours and stuff, I can because I can like literally listen and be like look over or whatever when I'm working or doing whatever I'm doing. So that's how my usually would be anyways. So. I guess if you're gonna chill with me and see what I do in my day, then that's how it's gonna be. Guys, this is why I think vlogging is gonna be hard for me because like, I don't know, I don't think I do like anything overly exhilarating or exciting. Do you know what I mean? Like, it's not that crazy. So I just got my dime. I printed nothing, I just wasted tape. These sequin gels here are absolutely gorgeous, guys. These are also from Benelisa. I do have a review on them as well. So go check out that video if you're interested in seeing them a little bit more in depth. But in all honesty, like these are just gorgeous. These are definitely for more encapsulation, I find. That is kind of why I'm going underneath the nail with this one. Just for the swatch. Oh, so pretty. So this is, yeah, exactly. Sequence color gel. And it's P21 to P32. Guys, these are the Fur Effect gels. And again, there is a whole video I have out with these. But I, like I said, for whatever reason in my brain, I want to have these swatches on top. Just as a quick reference, sometimes when I want something and I don't want to go digging through the rest of my swatches. Ooh. I don't know. That brown is not my favorite, nor is this red. I really like the effect that it gives. Here we are, guys. So I swatched these ones. Um, I'm not going to do the jelly gels because I just don't have that full collection yet, so... Yeah, cute. I like it. I like it. Alright, Alright, guys. So I'm gonna end the vlog here. I hope you guys enjoyed spending the day with me. Um, we got quite a bit done. We definitely got that drawer organized and everything on the swatch wheels, which I really like. A few other drawers back to normal. Um, clean. A um, couple videos filmed. It's like, we did good. We did good today. So it was a very productive day. But thank you guys so, so much. So make sure you go and hit that subscribe, give it a thumbs up, share. Maybe somebody else might like this video, have something that I might help them out with. But thank you guys so, so much. Don't forget to ch check out um, BR Nail Talk, the Facebook group. Like I said, guys, there's always exclusive stuff in there that I want to do, start doing. Like I said, I've only been doing it so long, so it's going to be a little time and we will well, we'll, we'll master it all. <laughs> okay, maybe not that far, but you know. Alright guys, bye. Have a great one.